Toyota presents Let's Go Places on the Recruiting Trail as we hit the road to meet some of the nation's best prospects. This week, we're stopping in Baton Rouge, Louisiana to meet All-American defensive back Kelvin Joseph. Scotlandville High School had perhaps its best season ever in 2016. The Hornets went 13-1 with the only loss coming in the Louisiana State Championship game. It was a good feeling because we never made it to a championship, so we made history. And we, we, we looking forward to going back again. Defensive back Kelvin Joseph played a big part in the run to the title game. For the season, he had 72 tackles and five interceptions. Three of those returned for touchdowns. His goal this season is to make a return to state with a better result. We're going to come back a dominant team. We went to this championship last year, but we lost, so we wouldn't, we coming back. Joseph split his time between cornerback and safety. Whichever position he plays, he routinely shuts down his part of the field. I'm, I'm a savage, you know? <laughs> Like on defense, I control it. Like, nothing, nothing able to come my way. I don't like that. I like to hit, catch picks, all that. <laughs> Growing up in Baton Rouge, it's easy for a kid to grow up an LSU Tiger fan. And when the young man starts playing defensive back at a high level, it's understandable why he'd be interested in joining the Tigers program. Joseph committed to LSU earlier this year, but he has since reopened his recruitment. He is still considering his hometown Tigers, but Alabama, Florida State, and Clemson are also in the picture. While he figures out his college situation, Joseph remains focused on closing out his high school career strong. I want to break a lot of records. I want to be all state. I want to be all American. I want to be all American. You can check one of those goals off the list. Joseph will be at the U.S. Army All-American game in January. Then some lucky college program will haul in one of the country's top defensive backs.